Want to know why? Ask how? Howard the Humongous. What's the next great thing that's going to make the iPad and the smartphone look obsolete? What's going to make the new Mac Air look silly? It's simple. Computers that can read your brain. How often do you wake up in the morning, halfway to the bathroom, have an absolutely brilliant idea, develop it um, paragraph by paragraph in your head while you sit there on the potty, and be absolutely certain that you're going to remember it by the time you get to the bedroom and get a chance to jot it down, only to discover that after you've exited from the bathroom and actually managed to find a peep of piece of paper and a pencil, the idea has utterly fled from your brain. What would happen if all of those brilliant ideas of yours were stored on the fly without your carrying any piece of equipment whatsoever? What happened if a computer somewhere in the house or somewhere in the cloud read your brain, took down your thoughts, and gave you utter privacy? What if two months later, when you were thinking about a random issue, all of a sudden the computer in the cloud came back to you and said hey I've got a thought that's relevant to what you're thinking right now remember that thought you had in the bathroom two months ago and reminded you about it what if in order to complete the thought while you're still sitting on the potty you need 15 facts what if the computer will go out like Google but a more advanced Google a mind reading Google and fetch the facts you need to either complete your thought or to demonstrate that you're on the wrong track and to help you get on the right track. What if you have all of the knowledge of the world available to you in your very own brain, totally searchable with intelligent agents fetching you the stuff that's relevant and keeping the stuff that's not relevant away while recording your thoughts for your future? and helping you find your way through the thoughts of the past that help knit what you're thinking right now together. Would life be just the tiniest bit different? Not to mention turning on all your appliances and turning them off with your brain and having intelligent helpers tell you when you're overusing an appliance and can save some energy. Would that help you in any way whatsoever? Not having to carry any equipment, but being able to walk into the bathroom in your pajamas or in nothing and find that's the only equipment you need and that you have all of a sudden one of the greatest brains ever seen on planet Earth. That's what's coming in the future of computers. That's the killer app beyond Microsoft, Facebook, and Apple. And hopefully you and I will help bring it to pass. This is Howard the Humongous speaking to you from the future. It's your job and my job to make now to see if I can find on this computer that cannot read my mind the off button.